Hello and welcome to another bootleg LEGO review. Today is not the usual kind of LEGO. You've probably seen the photo now or the title above. It's, it's LED keychain torches. Uh, so LEGO have been producing these keychain torches. Here's a legit uh, LEGO Darth Vader. <laughs> and one thing to know about these is that, you know, just like LEGO, you can't take their hands off. Uh, I can't take the legs off because there's electronics in there. Not the arm, the arms but too tight, but you can supposedly pop them off, and you can also pop the heads off, which uh, that'll come in important in a sec. Uh, and you know, the legs are the lights, shit, and you got the two lights there. Uh, they're pretty good, interesting, uh, of course, a lot bigger than actual Lego figures. Uh, so, uh, Bullet Company, uh, yeah. uh which uh, I've seen that company, but I can't remember what the fake Lego that they do, they don't do the main usual minifigure stuff, they still do other things. And uh, they produce uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Ninjago, hence the title, Ninjago vs TMNT, uh, keychain uh, LED lights, so let's go through them. Uh, so here's here's one for uh, Ninjago, right there, and uh, Nog Cole says there, with lights LED. Uh, note that the chest is not printed like the rest of the body, but instead has the shell uh, logo on it. And the printing details are pretty good, uh, pretty decent. It's gold, no misprint stuff, but look at that a sec. And all of them have this uh, hole in the back hack that you can test it. It's pretty bright. Uh, on top it says uh, Ninja Minifigure, Minifigure Ninja LED Light. Six, six kinds of colors, only four on the back of the pack. Improve baby's perception of color. No. Attract the attention of children around, maybe. Children's toys, gifts of choice. <laughs> Workmanship, small but beautiful. Uh, one side that tells you how to replace the battery. Uh, on the back, it's got the four different kinds. Fine motor, hand-eye coordination, suit to buy more value. They have no idea what English is, do they? Uh, this is number 1686. 1685 for blue. Red is 1688 and green is 1687. And goes to the bottom usual sort of uh, warning and health safety stuff. Um, you might notice some of the tape here, all of them are taped down when they first get them. Pull them out, nothing inside, you've got this plastic tray. Which has been molded for the purpose of these. So uh, I'll get all of them out and do a jump cut. But before we do that, let's have a quick look at the uh, Ninja Turtle stuff. So Ninja Turtles 1681 for Raphael, 1682 for Mikey, 1683 for Donatello, and Leonardo is 1684. Uh, and notice uh, Donatello and, Ra and Leonardo have the same chest. Uh, Raphael and Michelangelo have the same chest, which is kind of annoying because then it's not really accurate. Uh, so what looks like on top, you got the Lego sort of photo at the top. Same text. And as usual, I have uh, taken photos of all of these and have put them uh, on Facebook. The link is below, you can go ahead and check that out. And you know, just notice that the uh, the Ninja Turtle tray is cross shaped for Ninja Turtle and it's slightly different to the rest. So, jump cut. So, first, let's take a look at the blue Ninjago. Uh, a lot lighter shade of blue than the actual minifigure. I believe I remember it being a dark blue and not a navy blue. Uh, facial expression on all of them are the same, so. You know, they didn't differentiate the characters or anything. And of course, all of them have the same mold. And just like the uh, leg ID, you can sort of swap the hands. Uh, articulation wise, he's a bit looser than the official stuff. Printing is. Oh, come on, head, come on. A bit tight there. Printing cost is a bit. Uh, it's okay. Um, nothing groundbreaking or anything, but uh, it's accurate enough. Even printed the legs and the um, uh, the, 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 the hip joint. 
and uh, yeah, the molding is completely identical to the official stuff. Oops. So let's take that bit head off and hands off. So just to demonstrate if they fit. Well, this one's really loose. <laughs> that doesn't fit. Uh, what about the head? Does the head fit? Yeah, yeah, kind of. It's loose. It doesn't come off anything. So, and that's just the power. Okay, this is the lake and cost tough either. Uh, that's the one I've had for a while, but I've only used it like a few times, so the battery should still be decent enough. You can see uh, the bootleg is a lot brighter. Uh, also has, you know, so the colors are slightly uh, different. Yeah, uh, so one could say that the bootleg is better here because, you know, it's a lot brighter. I thought that's what the light is for. But uh, you also might want to consider, you know, kids shine these lights at their faces and the eyes. And maybe you do want a soft light. Uh, last thing compared to the actual real one is that they both have, you know, printed face inside, obviously. Next we have the Night Ride Ninja. Uh, printed gold and accurate as it should be. Um, a slight misprint on the black on the top, maybe, but overall, looks just fine. Come on, sit tight. Okay, green ninja. Not the silver is uh, isn't the best printed, but uh, it looks okay. Finally, we have the red ninja. Which uh, most of the details gone because uh, most of the details meant to be at the center of his chest where the uh, Zhao logo is. So oopsie you, bad days for you. Okay, finally we get to Ninja Turtles. First we got Donatello. Uh, the eyes are quite low resolution printed, as you can see them. Maybe you see them camera uh, around the pupils, just outside the black area. It's got black dots to simulate sort of shading, just like in old newspapers. Uh, the printing on the shell is scratches marks, sort of, and uh, just, yeah. As you can take off his head, oh, and he's is accurately printed, and uh, you know, only then can you reveal the uh, battery case on the back and a hollow shell. So, oh. Yeah, he's, he's okay, articulation. A uh, bit of excess plastic on the emoting injection and such. The O. That's the same uh, chest printing as uh, Donatello. But, uh, you know, has a different face. Like, they pay attention to the faces, but not the bodies. Oopsies. Raphael, he has a really loose hand. Um, just like a character. Badoonch. Again, uh, printing wise, just a few marks here and there. We've got a cheap bootleg, these are fine. I mean, like, uh, these are $15 each in Hong Kong. So, an actual ones, uh, like Darth Vader ones, would be like 80 something, or maybe 100. So, it's, it's less than a quarter the price. And it's brighter. I think Mikey's eyes are slightly misprinted lower, which is annoying. But the one good thing about these is that you can choose and pick. Because it's got a window on the box, you know, you're not, you know, you see a bootleg and you think, oh, the box has one thing, but the, is the quality going to be the same as what it says on the box? Well, no worrying here because you can actually uh, look at the window of the box and see for yourself if these are worth it or not. Uh, so that, that's a huge plus. Um, one of the reasons why I didn't get some of the Star Wars bootleg was it was in the, like a blister pack, you can see everything in there. So that wasn't very good. I uh, didn't get any. Like I wanted to do a review show on something really terrible, but then I'd be wasting money because what am I gonna do with something that's really terrible? I can't sell it. I can't use it. So that's one reason why I didn't get one of the bootlegs um, in Hong Kong. 
That was also that the CP toys uh, copy being. Well, I did get the CP one because you can see that on the video, YouTube. Yeah, it's kind of hard to balance these with a giant metal thing on the back. So that's uh, Ninjago and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles keychain LED Lego bootleg. So uh, tell me what you think. You can check out the photos of the box arts and such, and um, photos of these guys on the Facebook link below. And of course, subscribe to just comment below. And take care and have a nice day. Bye. No, you don't. I hear the comments too. You know. We shan't stop the superiors from entering our world. What's that? I think he wants to play now. <laughs> I can't kill you. I'm with the superiors now. Now I'll kill you. <laughs>